Hey guys, Keyboard.exe here. In today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to get a Frutiger Arrow theme for your Windows 11 machine. It's fairly easy, just a few GitHub downloads, and yeah, let's jump right into it. Alright, so step one is going to be to go to this here link, which will be uh, linked in the bio, and you're going to download OpenShellSetup.exe. So, we're going to wait for that to finish installing. We're going to click Next, and then we're going to um, accept the terms, click Next again. And install allow to make changes to device and then we're going to finish the install um after that we're going to go to this link here which will also be in the uh bio and we're going to install this uh this one right here considering you're on a 64-bit machine which if you're on windows 11 you most likely are um this is a retro bar then you open the zip and then you're going to run this exe or you're going to extract it um to whatever you'd like now, once you've done this, you're going to open RetroBar. Oh, if you get this, just click Run anyway. It might give you a hard time. So it says install this to run the application. So let's just uh, get this done. You might get this as well. Um, and in that case, you're just going to run this in addition. Sometimes Windows gives a hard time about stuff that was made for uh, older older versions of Windows, some sort of proprietary file or something like that. Now, once you've done that, you're going to launch RetroBar. Might take a moment. At which point, as you can see, the bar has changed, but this is not what we'd like. What we're going to click is Properties, and then we're going to click Advi or Taskbar, and then we're going to change this to Windows Vista Arrow. The next step after this is we're gonna to toggle this box here. This is allow for font smoothing. That just um, makes everything look just a little bit smoother. Now, if you've correctly installed OpenShell, you're gonna to go to here and you're gonna type in OpenShell menu settings. At which point you're gonna to go to this tab here, which says skin and you're gonna select Windows Arrow. You're gonna click okay. And then now when you open this, it's gonna appear this way. Um, the last and final step is to find a Frutiger Arrow inspired wallpaper, download it, and apply it, and at which point your system will be entirely skinned in this style. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was helpful, and have a good one. Keyboard.exe, signing off.